Alright everyone, I'm gonna show you um, a very cool website that which can be um, run perfectly actually on a mobile device Nokia 900. Okay, so um, as we know the default mobile browser um, preloaded with the Nokia 900 it's a very nice one with the full flash support and yeah, so I've personally tested a lot of um, websites which can be run perfectly like um, even you can play the flash games on pop cap games on on, on, a, on the default browser so today we're gonna try something new and something really interesting it's called flashers it's quite similar with the Google Maps or you can have this Google Earth, but what this one is full flash based, and as you can see, it's it's really really nice. Well, yeah, it's loaded. So we click that. You see that all the maps they're based on flash techniques. So, well. Someone maybe think um, you got laggy things like in the hundred and um, performance, but actually you get really really fluid user experiences. Like push the button A, it's gonna zoom out. Right, let's get rid of that. Okay, so if you push the button that you can see you're zooming in now well I can use the stylus but because I'm I don't have a video camera I have to use my iPhone 3GS to take the, the video so um, I don't have my third hand but you can see it's quite it's quite it runs quite smoothly no lag right and we're well, using the navigate pad here you can move on the maps right so basically you, do, you don't really need to worry about the resistive screen about in a hundred well I hope it was a capacitive one but it's not okay that's London 9 so um, we take a look at it. We want to rotate the map a little bit. Right, as you can see, it's been rotated quite fluently. Right, we rotate to that direction. Okay. So we zoom in again. Uh, let's zoom out. Okay, we zoom in again here. Okay. You can see the map is highly detailed and contains a lot of um, information things. Well, the here, the map source I'm using is the Microsoft tab, it's called Microsoft Vero Earth. And if you use the, the, the sources below, the Microsoft VE and see all the street names will display on the map and also some um, points of interest so we try here we take out the, the, the stylus right we take out the stylus and we choose the map source here Right, it's not very clear, but I'll just try to zoom in, see if you can. Well, a 3DS is, is not very good at taking um, video details, but yeah, the focus is not very good. But as you can see, um, all the streets names came up right and yeah it's much
much better to in a in a in the Biden view. Yeah. See all the names, all the streets names, points of interest, um London's sounds names, everything just came up. If you just choose a Microsoft B E labels map source. Well I've tried the Yahoo Maps, it's just not very good. And also see that the first one um, the map source is from NASA is pretty good but I really suggest you use that source on your Mac or PC because um, it's quite laggy if you use that source it's on your N100 but the, the Microsoft the tab maps is, is pretty good it's quite satisfying quite full of user experiences that's that's the most that's the most the best map I've ever used so far here on a mobile device, especially you use that through your mobile um, browser actually, it's not a standalone application. So what else could we ask for? That's, that's everything basically, that's pretty good, see that, and here, quite clear, you just use that on your and a hundred mobile divisor. Right. Okay. Let's close that. So don't you don't try don't try that Firefox, because it, it doesn't support um it doesn't currently support the flash techniques. So I've I've had a <coughs> a shortcut here just to access to the flashers um quickly and easily and yeah, if you want to remember the name, the the the, the address for the website, it just flasheearth.com. You just point your mobile browser to this website, and it will just turn up. Right. Thanks for watching.